Hi, I'm from Syntax Technologies. You can contact me with this information. Please go to facebook.com slash syntax technologies to like my page. You can have all the latest information regarding my company and also SQL accounting system. By the way, I'm one of the dealer for SQL accounting system. So if you wish to purchase training or sign up maintenance support, you can always contact me. You can also go to youtube.com slash syntax technologies to get all the previous videos regarding SQL accounting system starting with how to do installation and presetting for it in lesson 1 and lesson 2. In today's lesson, this will be the last part of all the transactions in SQL accounting system. So I finish it with supplier refund. Supplier refund normally means that you pay a deposit to supplier or you have made a payment and you want to refund back so basically what you need to do is just go to supplier refund click new so you select the supplier by typing the name if when you type the name the supplier does not come up it's because the highlight is not at company name but at other column so you just click at tab tab at your keyboard and come back to company name so I select this so you can notice that or any payment that you have made before will show at the bottom so what you need to do is you just key the amount you want to refund for example 100 so what is the amount that supplier refund to you and the check number and take which payment you want to knock off or you want to refund and save so you can always print our official receipt or actually it's a refund voucher so remember when you make printing you can also convert the printing document into others format by clicking at print print to file you can select other format for example pdf and put where you want to save then you can get your pdf for this report when you go into any transaction the first page is a listing so as you can see the first row is empty meaning that you are using this row to do searching okay so you can also do a special feature called view chooser by right click at any column header view chooser this is to pull out any available field to the main screen for you to searching and it's easy to use for example you use the check number just type the check number that it will show the check number that you want. So over here, seven. If this is the format or column that you always want, remember right click again, go to grid layout, save layout, and put a name for it. Take set this layout as default, save. This when you go out and come in again, the column that have you so customize or pull will still be there so that's all for today starting next week i'll continue with sql payroll system for those who never touch on payroll it's a good chance for you to learn what's all about payroll what is so epf pcb how to do payroll how to do lift so stay tuned, I'm Brian from Syntech Technologies, thank you.